Take a chance, you never know But you don't know it's beautiful Hi guys and welcome back to my channel or to my channel if you are new okay so i know i look crazy right now i'm missing my head but it's okay this is what the video is about so today we're going to be talking about um this wig that has been trending all over youtube for like the last few months um headband wigs which i just feel like whoever came up with that was just like it's just like a genius like you won't gotta have no lace like no glue you don't gotta worry about tacking nothing down literally have the headband on and like call it a day so this video spe um, specifically and this type of wig is like for you girls who want to like dip into the wig scene but you know not too comfortable with all of like the lace and glue and frontals and stuff like that or if you're just lazy low-key <laughs> when it comes to your hair because it's not that much to it so if you are interested in figuring out you know what this wig is what it's about or if this is something that is for you stick around for this video but if you are new, welcome to my channel. Here we're all about faith, beauty, self-love, and empowerment. I hope you feel all four of those things whenever you come here and watch any of my videos. If you want to be a part of the family, go ahead and subscribe to my channel. And for everyone else included, go ahead and give this video a thumbs up. And if you haven't already, turn on your post notifications so you can be notified when I upload next. But let's get into the video. So the headband wig that I have here today is from the company Beauty Forever. Um, if you guys are OGs to my channel, it's not that long but you guys know that i did a review on a wig that i made from them before so i went ahead and picked up a headband wig from them as well they're like the cheapest that i found that i was comfortable with um as far as the company that i was comfortable with purchasing from um so the wig did come in this beauty forever box this is what all of their hair come inside of and then inside of it you know has the hair the wig is already out just because i wore it the other day but the hair um came in this um, plastic baggie with like a little hairnet um, attached to it and then as always they did send some goodies these goodies I'm not sure what they were thinking but <laughs> I mean hey I don't know but they did send two headbands just two now when I seen a few other people review their wigs I don't know if it's because they sent them the hair but they had like six headbands like multiple headbands so I was expecting to have the same thing as well but they only sent two and I probably would honestly never wear them they sent this one which is like pink and have like some birds or whatever I feel like it's very kitty and then they sent this one which is very giving me like tropical like spring vibes I guess this won't be bad for like the spring but as far as like now I won't wear it I probably won't even wear it in general but yeah and then you know all wig companies that send you the little wig caps with these are actually like i rack these up because these is the caps that i wear and then these next two items that they sent i don't know if they have leftover stuff from like halloween or something but they sent this hairpin but it's a hand can you guys see that like it's a hand and like um bedazzled or whatever i won't wear that at all and then they sent like this little mask you know, like people wear it to like them type of like masquerade balls or whatever. I don't know. I guess that's what they have for their Halloween stuff. But that's what I got with the box. And then here we have the hair. Um, So I did wear it a few times already for work. But it still has the natural um like waves in it. I made sure not to touch it. I just wore it in a ponytail. Um, But this is the natural um pattern and everything. This is their body wave in the 16 inch. So then as far as construction, we have the cap here. Um, it comes with a comb at the top, a comb at the bottom. And then if you guys can see, you do have like the adjustable um, strap right there. And then obviously the Velcro that you would use to um, secure the headband. Now, as far as this um, construction, I did have a wig previously, not from the same company, but I had a kinky curly headband wig and they had the combs on the um top to bottom and two on the sides i like the ones the two on the sides just because i felt like i was more secure these aren't bad but you know this is i guess this is just how they made theirs then as far as the construction i can tell that this is going to be a little iffy i shouldn't say i could tell like it is a little iffy because they sewn they sewed the hair on top of the headband can you guys see that instead of under it so it's on top of it so it makes it look a little bit bulky like it's not seamless um so that's i feel like that's the only thing that i didn't like about the hair even when it came to me wearing it the like two times that i did 
um is the fact that they had the hair on top instead of under if it was under it would have been better it would have been like a nice smooth transition but they had it on top so i have my hair smoothed back and laid back already as you guys can tell i'm tired of looking crazy so let's go ahead and put this wig on so what i normally do for all of my wigs is i do the bottom and just like stick my head in but yeah It's attaching to my lip gloss so yeah with the adjustable straps you can um loosen it or tighten it up to your liking right now i left it how how it was but i might on days that i don't put the comb in i might put um make the adjustable strap at its tightest but yeah i don't want to put yeah i don't think i want to put the comb in because i'm gonna have to mm. yeah i'm not gonna put the comb in we're gonna do it without the comb let me scoop my chair down so you guys can see okay and then you just have the velcro here the only thing that i will say about the velcro um compared to the headband wig that i had before the velcro piece was a lot longer so like here let me turn around here is sticking out i hope you guys can see that versus the velcro that I had on the wig before like it was all the way down so like that would be flat but this is sticking out but I guess since you weren't a headband like it'll be flat with the headband but if you depending on how type of headband you use but like the, the ones that they sent with the little skinny piece um I wouldn't like that so I just wish that the velcro piece was a little bit thicker but this is the wig I'm gonna pull it back some just because I did do my edges um, one thing about this headband um wig that I love is that if you want to pull it all the way back, you know, we're not all the way back, but like, um, depending on how the headbands that you want to wear, if you want to pull it back to the middle and have your edges out, you can't, or, you know, if you don't want to do your edges, you want just like that full blown headband effect, you could have it all the way up to the front. So I definitely wouldn't wear the wig just like this. Um, I will put an actual headband over it because like I said, I hope you guys can see it's bulky right here because they didn't they sold it on top instead of under it so it's not very seamless and the width as far as the headband itself like it's wider back here and then it thins on the side i wish it was just like the same all the way across um so i feel like the construction could have been better for the wig but the hair itself i love the hair like it's super super soft as soon as i got it out the box the first time like i was like oh my god like i can run my fingers through it like super super easy um it was very soft so i love that it does have like a little um factory smell but i like that's for a lot of wigs sometimes they have that factory smell so you know if you wash your wigs as soon as you get them you should be fine so without a headband, you know, it's not bad. It's cute or whatever. I'm definitely, it's too flat for me. I need some a little bit more volume. So I'm going to curl it a little bit. But this is what it looks like. I think this wig is like super cute, super convenient. Like this is like something you could wear to the gym. You could throw into wear to the grocery store, throw in the wear at, to work, depending on what you do. Um, I, even depending on what you do, if you if you got to be dressed up, I feel like you still wear this, put on a nice headband. Um, or, you know, if you just want it up in a bun or something like that, that'd be cool too. Like this is just the perfect, lazy, comfortable, easy to go one, two out the door. I'm going to go ahead and put some curls at the top and then show you guys what that looks like. track loose do y'all see this can y'all see that i don't know if y'all can see that just a whole piece of a track loose i'm gonna have to sew that what in the world beauty forever i will say this wig i don't really got a curl on my head just because i'm not worried about no part or nothing i could do this on a mannequin normally on my other wigs i curl on my head so that way i can like get a feel but 
I want a headband and it's no like lace or nothing. So I feel like it'd be quicker if it was just on a mannequin instead. This Velcro was sticking up. Since I flipped it, they're a little all over the place. But sure, you could even move it forward a little bit, make it seem like you got a little bang. <laughs> Not the bang. The bang. Am I saying that right? Is that the beat? I don't think that's the beat. That's the beat in my head. But this is still cute, so let's try on some headbands. I'm not gonna try on those ones because I don't know what they were sneaking on these when they sent me those. But I have a whole bunch of them from the first time when I ordered a headband wig. I bought a whole bunch of headbands, so let's try some on. So here I just have like some normal ones. These is like the just the simple like solid headbands. This is what I wear to work. I have some other ones. So I have this white and black headband that I got from um my quality hair when I ordered the kinky curly headband wig. Um so let's try this on. I wanted something to cover up that. Oh, who is she? But this is the first headband. This headband is super thick. So I would wear this probably if I had my hair up in a bun. When I got the first headband wig, I did buy some like um printed headbands off of Amazon. So I have like four different prints. I'm like loving like the cheetah print lately. So I have this. These ones are the skinny backs. So I would wear this if my hair was down like it is now. But let's just try one on. The only thing is I will say with these headbands, I feel like you know you're gonna be looking a little bit younger than you would if you was actually wearing like a full blown lace wig. I'm feeling this cheetah print one. This is probably my favorite one. But you know, you can't wear a cheetah print all the time and with everything. Like I said, you're going to look like a kid. So for that reason, I went ahead and went over to Amazon again and got some solid colored headbands like this. But the back is a little bit thicker. Maybe I'll do the green one just for you guys to see. But yeah, so it's like constructed how the first one is, the white and black one. But it's just not as like thick as far as the material has that one with is. But yeah, so let's try on this one. I just want to pause this video real quick just to say that it is my anniversary so babe if you are watching this which i know you are i just want to say that i love you and happy anniversary and thank you so much for supporting me especially with this entire youtube journey and text me okay <laughs> sorry guys back to the video but guys that's it as far as like all the headbands i really don't feel like i need to show you guys anymore just because y'all get the gist this wig is so perfect it is so versatile and so easy to just like do and just like so effortless um, you know, you could rock it this way. You could flip it over to the other side if you want to. I'm not because I already curled it. You could do like a half up, half down, like kind of style with it. If that's something that you're interested in. I feel like my head is too big with the headband to do like a half up, half down. You could put it in a low ponytail, a high ponytail if you want. If you haven't tried one yet, maybe you'll go out and try one. Because if you don't, I don't know what you're thinking. Like, even if you're not even a wig person, I wouldn't even consider this a wig. I consider it a sewing. You got your edges out. You got part of your hair out. You could do a little bit more with the wig than just like a normal closure. You know, if it was a frontal, different story. But I'm a closure girl. So I could do more with this than I would with a normal closure. 
I don't see these headband wigs going like anywhere at all, at least no time soon. I would definitely leave the link below to my wig and the length that I have and the website. Again, this is from Beauty Forever Hair. And I love the scent, um, the 16 inch, just because it comes to my shoulders. So it gives me a natural look in general. But overall, I just love this wig. Like, there's nothing else for me to say with this video. I'm just going to continue to talk about how much I love it. I think you guys get the picture. But guys, that is it. Thank you so much for tuning into this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it and love this look just as much as I do. If you haven't already, please go ahead and give this video a thumbs up and drop something down in the comments. Let me know if you're going to try this wig out. They come in pretty much all of the other textures that you will get in normal bundles and a normal wig. So definitely go ahead and try this out. Make sure you guys follow me on my social media handles that are listed down below, especially on Instagram. That is I am Deja Nicole and that is Deja with two A's. But thank you so much for tuning in. And as always, I will see you guys next Wednesday, Lord's willing. Peace. Take a chance, you never know. But you don't know if you